Hi there, students. Plaintive, plaintive, an adjective. Plaintively, the adverb. Okay, plaintive means sad, sorrowful. Um, so the dog looked at me plaintively, asking for food. Yeah, um, plaintive, sad, sorrowful. The plaintive cry of the seagulls on the beach. Let's see, this word plaintive, I get the feeling also it has a nuance of asking for something to be corrected. Yeah, you're complaining that something is wrong. If you actually look at this word plaintive, plaint, complaint, it's got the plaint bit and these two words are actually cognates. Um, okay, so a plaintive look, a plaintive sigh, a plaintive uh, moan. Um, a uh, The plaintive sound of the bagpipes. Hark, I can hear the plaintive sound of the bagpipes in the distance. Sorrowful, mournful, melancholic. Yeah, um, this group um, typically produce plaintive music. Um, you have a plaintive look on your face. Clearly there's something wrong. Notice plaintive ending V-E is different from plaintiff ending T-I-F-F. A plaintiff is somebody in court who um, has taken somebody to court. So a plaintiff, a plaintiff is somebody in a, uh, a civil legal case who um, is complaining to the court, is complaining to the, the judge. It's the party bringing a, um, a, a civil lawsuit. So it's the accuser, the complainant, the litigant, if you like. OK, but let's get back to plaintiff, plaintive, plaintive. Sorrowful, sadful, wistful, sad, yeah, um, expressing sorrow. Yeah, a plaintive melody. So sad, sorrowful, pathetic, melancholy, pitiful, woeful, mournful, uh, grief-stricken, disconsolate, woebegone. Yeah, um, uh, I heard a, pl uh, a plaintive little voice saying, what about me? You've forgotten me. OK, so plaintive, used to describe something slightly sad, very often uh, a plaintive sound, but it could, you could have a plaintive look as well. Yeah, it's something that has a sad quality, particularly um, a sound, yeah, a, uh, a s sad and mournful, OK? Um, he, plain he, uh, he looked so plaintive there on his own, all forlorn and lost. Um, yeah, a plaintive cry, a plaintive request. Please, 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 he asked me plaintively. OK, so uh, as I said, there's this nuance between the lines of, as well of something of your asking for something to be corrected, something that's wrong. And I think that's why you get the plaintiff in a court case as well. Um, plaintive, how formal. I think I'd probably give it 6.5 in formality, yeah. Um, it sounds pretty literary. Um, it would sound great in a poem or um, uh, something artistic. Plaintive in an informal conversation. Sad, yeah, I think sad would be much better. Plaintive, use it in a semi-formal conversation, semi-formal writing or something more formal than that. And then as to origin, well, um, it comes from uh, French, plaintif, uh, meaning lamenting or aggrieved, um, which, okay, itself comes from um, Latin, um, planctus, which actually means the beating of your breast in lamentation. Oh, 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 to beat the breast, yeah, and... Uh, Plango, to beat the breast in lamentation. 
and that, that's the origin okay so plaintive yeah it's related to the word complaint the plaint bit is the same um plaintive sad sorrowful mournful and plaintiff somebody who takes a court case against someone else enough if you enjoyed the video give it a rating subscribe to my channel and i'll see you soon bye for now plaintive and plaintiff